Actually, I'm gonna go barefoot. So now that I've figured out my thing and what I'm doing and how I'm going to do it, I'm not going to set specific times, more how I spend each hour of the day. So if I have a day that's more busy or I need to sleep in because I have to stay up late to film something or do something, the day starts when I wake up. I'm giving myself 15 minutes to get up and then after that, I'm going on a 45 minute walk each morning. Just now myself and me, I got that new thing, new not only is doing this walk really important for my health and waking up, but it also gives me an opportunity to get some good time lapses and intro scenes for each day's vlog. Alright, my 45 minutes is basically up, so I'm just heading back to the house. And then we're going to talk about what's next of my routine. Get the taste. Next, quick shower and get ready for the day. Round. I say jump and they say so far today, we've had 15 minutes to wake up, 45 minutes to walk, get some footage, some time lapse, and I'm assigning myself up to an hour to have breakfast. This includes cooking, cleaning, eating and socializing with Melanie, and just spending some time to connect before the day starts, and I delve into my work and go into World with Timothy, where the time just zooms past, and I've got no idea what's going on. And that's the first two hours of my day. Jin managed to break past our defenses and open one of the doors, and he was extremely muddy and extremely happy. I got completely distracted because we had a whole SWAT team outside our house of about 8 to 10 people that were all dressed up in army uniform, high-vis jackets. I had a good chat with them. So you're looking for someone or...? And what I found out was that the people living in the house next door had been in contact with someone that was known to have COVID. So they were testing them to make sure they're clear to prevent further spread. We've only been here two days and we haven't come into contact with them, so we're all good. Now we're getting on to the next section, which is work. I'll be doing this until midday. I ran a little bit over at 10 minutes past 12, but the video's finished and I'm pressing render. That brings me on nicely to how this actually works. It's not as straightforward as you're gonna see in this vlog. This vlog is a variation of how it can work and what the average day is probably going to look like. But here's the idea behind it. My average day is about 16 hours long. I've broken those 16 hours down into blocks of time with assigned tasks to do that I can mix and match to make the day how it needs to be. There are two things that I need to do in a day to keep me productive and healthy. The first is to manage my work, which breaks down into these sections here. These are in order of priority. I have to do a minimum of four hours of editing every single day. That's unavoidable. And then we've got the exercise blocks. You've already seen how I want to do most mornings and you're about to see how I do exercise. Within these times, I also have this 20% rule where a street dog just came into the house and tried eating our dog's dog food. And obviously that just caused a huge fight and my camera almost went down. <laughs> I'm just going with a new position it's ended up in. But yes, I have this 20% rule where I can modify the times of the slots that I've chosen for the day by 20%, positive or negative, which means that if my energy isn't going in that direction, then I can stop early, take more of a break, be more reset to do more later. Or if I'm in a really good flow, I don't have to stop, but it prevents me from going on for longer and then running myself into a ditch where I don't want to exercise because I've been sat down so long. And that's what I'm gonna do in the middle of the day. This way I can make sure that I meet my long-term fitness goals and be completely reset for this afternoon's editing session. I'm only taking my phone with me and it's gonna be on a tripod because I don't want to be thinking about filming when I'm trying to train.
the last block of the day that I have left is just to get another three hours of work in. Thanks for watching. See you soon.